Hello YouTube and welcome back to another TFT game with your buddy UC here. We are playing Pengu Party today and it looks like we got whatever that was. Champion something. Champion completed anvil. That is completely different. I really really want to get something that I remember well. But uh, there's so many different traits. I don't think they have everything that I like from my set that I'm thinking of which is set 5. I think it was set 5. Set 5 was my favorite set of all time but it's probably because it was like one of the first sets that i played i think it was like the second set that i played anyway i hope to see something from it oh i know mountain for sure gain two mountain hexes in the front row units standing in the mountain hex will gain a shield and permanent bonus health 400 shield 40 health that's pretty strong the Glacial Mallet is alright. Disco, Combat Start. Uh, I'm gonna take Mountain. I wanna play something tanky. Very tanky. Uh, sell this. Maybe like an Arcanist Porcelain build. It's looking pretty likely that I play something like that. Then I need an Alawi up here. Alawi would be fantastic. Now, I wonder what item I'll get as well from my completed anvil. Deer's really good definitely serves us in our AP conquest. Uh, Adaptive Helm is not bad. Warden. Another Warden for now. And I got an Arcanist. I would pre-level here if I had enough gold to, for sure. The two Mountain Hexes are gonna do great. What does two Mountain do? 600 shield, 60 health, the entire front row becomes Mountain Hexes. Okay, that's... That's pretty crazy, actually. I'm gonna pick up Shen just in case, actually. That's super crazy. Uh, I might sell. Yep. There's the pre-level. Well fed. I could, no, I don't want to go bruisers. I hate faded. I don't know what it is about it, but I don't like it. Best friends isn't really gonna work out if I get two mount. Divine rules. That's just a good one right there. Um, I'm not really sure why I took Divine Rolls, as it doesn't actually help me any when I think about it for more than two seconds. But it's too late to regret doing it. It's already done. Oh, that's not bad, though. Oops, I definitely shouldn't have sold that. Dude, there's so much Heavenly in my shop. What do I do? What do I even do? There's a Zoe and a... Dude, I gotta... I gotta, like, hold, right? I gotta, like, hold, right? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm cooking too fast. I'm burning myself in the kitchen. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I took Divine Rules. It's honestly all messed up. Uh, sadness. Nothing but sadness, everybody. I, uh, panicked a little bit. A little... Did a little bit of a panic. As it happens, you know? I'm gonna do this. And... Well, that's not gonna do anything. Let me see what Divine Rolls does. At the start of each stage, including this one, gain... Four free rerolls, plus one for each of your heavenly champions. I mean, I guess that's just four free rerolls every stage, so it's not that bad actually. I just didn't want any of the other augments that I saw there for sure. Those were really not great. Not great for the board I'm going for. And now if I can even get two heavenly in, it'll be pretty good. If I get a Soraka in, she'll give my whole team a little bit more AP, which will be pretty useful. So hopefully I just find a, like a really early Soraka and I'm able to put her in. Dragon Lord, I don't want that. I don't want any of that. Man, it would be so awesome to put in the Zoe. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Might as well. Okay, that and now, Soraka at level six will be pretty good. I'll have a pretty strong team then. Now all I need is some tank items. I wonder what other... Like, maybe the Coven upgrade wouldn't be too bad here. 
to make one really strong AP unit. Probably has a lot of AP right now. Yeah, 185 for this early in the game is a lot of AP. If only I had a jeweled gauntlet. Oh, the boss. Not the boss. Got him, though. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, oh, there's a Soraka right there. I definitely would take that. Where is... There's a rod right there as well. I would also take this rod. Can't. <laughs> no, not like that. Come on, you guys. But, yeah, I really need the Soraka. And she's gone. <laughs> uh, sword? No. I need a thanking item, so I guess I'll take this. Yeah, yeah, that's it's not bad. It's not bad. Maybe I'll have Alawi be my main tank. She's a warden and she is Arcanist. So she wouldn't be bad. Oh, Elderwood. I don't want the boss augment. I don't think I want to play that again. I just played it last game. So I'm going to take Elderwood. Yes. Sell that. I think we beat this guy. He does not look too strong, and I feel like we've played our cards well. But why does he have a fortune emblem he's not using? That's a little odd. Oh man, I think Alawi's gonna really be a good tank with everything that she's getting. I don't know whether to take the second mountain or Elderwood. Probably Elderwood, just so I could buff up my whole team. Ooh, four free rerolls. I mean, I would love that just to get a Soraka real quick. Dang, dude. That works. That's hilarious. I got so many things that I needed, I don't regret rolling down there. Got a two-star Mumu, though. Now I can put him right there. You know what? He might even be worth putting right there now that he's so strong and so big and strong. Didn't find a Soraka, though. Although, I suppose I didn't need her too badly yet. I did use all my gold, though. So, it's a little... It's a little... Hmm. You know what I mean? Maybe if I could get a two-star Alawi soon, it'll all be worth it. Dude, look at it. Look at Lux go. Maybe I could three-star Lux as well. I might be able to three-star yeah, I'm definitely taking that second Elderwood uh, augment. It's just going to make my whole team a lot stronger. I think I win this against the Cupcakes. If you're enjoying this type of content, make sure you consider leaving a like on the video and subscribing. It really helps. It really, really helps. And if you're one of my regular viewers that likes watching me, please do it. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, that's a two-star Alawi. That's pretty awesome. Oh yeah, I get some free rerolls here. Let me go ahead and do that. Dude, no. Oh man, I, I'm about to three-star like my whole board. No Soraka, but it literally looks like I'm gonna three-star like my whole board or something. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the jeweled gauntlet because I really wanted that and then I'll put this on a moo moo here And I think I should transfer those items over onto a I just think she would benefit more since she has the arcanist Or arcanist going for her. She'd probably do more damage, you know Oh that yone is a little scary He might win he's Keeps dodging all my moves dude Please stop whiffing. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, he's really strong now. He's playing that well. He's playing that pretty well. Champ dupes. I'll take some champ dupes. I don't usually take this, but... I think uh, it's going to do pretty well here. Oh, come on, man. I thought it was just going to give me all everything that I needed. How come now? How come no? I would have taken the whole item had I known I wasn't going to get anything. <laughs> I could still 3-star Nico. Yeah, she would be better there too. They deserve these bonuses. 
I maybe looking back on it, maybe I shouldn't have rolled down a zero. Not the greatest idea. But hey, I want to keep that win streak. And I definitely want to get all of my three stars. Come on. Go for it. Oh, dude, my poor Alawi, bro. What happened to her? She never stood a chance. She never stood a chance. Oh, well. Good thing the rest of my team did. That was close. Nah, I guess it wasn't that close. I gotta stop emoting on people. It's like a habitual reflex. Ascot, Shirima, Phantom, Bilgewater. Yeah, I, I will just take any three star at this point. I'm not gonna be that picky about it. Oh, what what augment is it gonna be? Camp dupes? Little buddies? Nope. Nope. Heavenly Crest? Yes. Yes for Heavenly Crest. And an eco, dude? I need uh, three star all of these. There we go, three Heavenly. Awesome. Awesome, and I'm about to three star Nico. Awesome. Would be. Nah, you know what? That's fine. That's fine for now. I was gonna ultimately pass it to Lux eventually, but not yet. I wonder if this counts for my free rerolls. I think it should. For my heavenly rerolls, my heavenly rolls. I also forgot the fact that I could get really lucky and find another Heavenly Spat. Man, the one thing I really don't want to do is get stuck at level 6. That's never worked out for anybody for a really long time, but... I mean, my team's holding up pretty alright. Spatula? Just kidding, it's not like I'd ever get it anyway. I'm last pick. Maybe I just take units that I need since I'm kind of basing this comp off of 3-starring as many units as I can. So, Lowie would be good. Lowie would be great. I'd even build that Dragon's Claw on her if I got the chance to get her. Come on, let me get that Lowie, bro. Yeah. He, he thought he was, like, tricking me or something. Well, luckily, I want this is what I wanted. I wanted Lowie. Elderwood, for sure, is the way to go here. And I'm just gonna build this dragon's claw so she can heal up. This is my choice. Dang, dude. Dang, dude. I'm really just staying level six though, so I can get my Lux. I think I just have to go level seven, and then I'd have like a lot higher chance of seeing the rest of my board as well. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna end up doing here. Somehow, I'm got two gold to my name. Man, Elderwood is kind of popping off right now. I think it built all the stacks there. It only goes up to five stacks. Okay, I see. For some reason, I thought it went up to infinite stacks, which would be pretty insane. It'd be kind of cheating if it did that. Hey, that's, that's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. She's better, right? She's a three star. She's an Arcanist and Heavenly, so it's not like she doesn't benefit from all that stuff. Maybe I would even put a Jeweled Gauntlet on her and she'd do some damage. I might try that out, actually. I think that'd be pretty funny. Look, let's see. Bam. Yeah, maybe a Jeweled Gauntlet would be good on her. I don't know. Nah. I just leave it on Lux. I'm gonna three star Lux as well, anyway. Dang, why is my team doing so much damage, dude? Got kind of a strong board. Shirima. Oh, this guy has Shirima in set, dude. This set's gonna be insane. Or should I say, Yone? Yone's gonna be insane. What if I, like, did that, you know? That'd be pretty good, right? Heavenly looks. 
think Heavenly Lux would be pretty good. Maybe I should add in more Heavenly units. What am I going to add in level 7? That's actually a pretty great question. I don't know. But I do need to go level 7. Oh, well, just like that. Um, wait, I'm not going to slam that, though. Oh, dude, there's a Lux right there. Come on, give me something good. Give me the Lux. I couldn't get the Lux, but I'm only one away. So now I definitely level up real fast and do what I gotta do here. I forgot to switch the Jeweled Gauntlet back because I got all distracted with rolling down and stuff, but I, do, I think it is better on Lux. And then just have uh, Alawi have that Heavenly. Give her more HP and AP, you know? <laughs> Nico can't even take damage, though. So that's, that's kind of awesome. She's just sitting there like like it was nothing. Tanking all that. Let me go ahead and do this. And that. Okay, well that's... It's pretty cool. There's no heavenly unit in my shop for me to place in there. Another stone plate or a thorn mail would be really good. I would put a thorn mail preferably if I had one, but I don't even have a chain vest yet. What other heavenly should I add? I would love to add in a Wukong for attack speed, but we'll see about that. We're only just level 7, so pretty unlikely that we see Wukong Invoker. Dude, I would love to have... Dude, I almost sold Alawi. That would have been so sad. I would have cried. There we go. Hey, there's my three-star Lux. So, for my third item, I would definitely do, like, an Archangels on my Lux. Or a Rabidons. Or maybe I should do, like, a Rage Blade. Like, Rage Blade wouldn't even be bad on her. She'd... She'd attack pretty fast. I'd prefer an Archangels, I think, out of anything, because this is like, this is kind of a stall comp. So, I would be able to stall for quite a bit until all my Archangels builds up enough to be whatever carry that they have. Just like right there. Dude, my board is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, I really like this board that I've made for myself. I would replace Zoe, unless I 3-star Zoe, I would replace her with a Lissandra. Zoe would be really good. I need that tier. Oh, it's gone. Okay, then... I don't know what to get. <laughs> Giant Slayer, maybe? I don't know if Giant Slayer would be that bad, actually, on my looks, on my 3-star looks. Yeah, I guess that's what I'll take. It's a Giant Slayer. Oh! My chunk was too big. I really didn't mean to take that. I don't think it's bad that I did, though. I think she could work as a replacement for my Zoe. Oh, another champ dupe. Mm. Sell these two. Very close to an Amumu. Just one away. And... You know what? I don't know if Syndra's worth it right now. I think I'd just rather three-star everything. I think that's what I'd rather have. Dang, no, no items, though. No, nothing slammable for me right now. I don't think I want to put any of that stuff in. Oh, this guy's level eight. Oh, oh this is the, the Yone player, I think. Nice, that stun was that stun was phenomenal right there. Ooh, dude, my Lux is carrying pretty well. I think if I can keep uh, three-starring my units, I'll be in a really good spot here. All these free rerolls are definitely helping out. I mean, 
Just gotta take the three star, right? You bet I don't have a an Arcanist bat. Arcanist bat would be pretty good right now. Three star of Moo Moo though. It's pretty huge. I think I'll do this still. Yeah, I will pick up this Malphite. He actually gives me more armor, which is just making my team tank here, so that's actually really good. That I got him. I'm really close to three stars Zoe as well. I'm thinking about putting that jeweled gauntlet on her. I think it would help my team do more damage. Amumu's taking zero damage though. <laughs> he took zero damage, like actually. Okay, the only difference between him and the Arcanist is like 30 AP of difference, so I think I'm gonna put the items on him. I think I'm gonna put these items on him and just let him tank there in the middle. Yeah, the only difference is like 30 AP. And Amumu's just like super tanky and heals for eternity for some reason, so... I think I'm gonna have him there. Let's see how many Alawis are out there so I can see if I should reroll for her. This guy doesn't have any. This guy has a 2 star, which sucks for me. No Alawi. Not many Alawis. Rolling down for her might not be the worst idea. I mean, I get a bunch of free rerolls, right? I almost sold something I needed. Come on. Okay, well, two star Malphite is not the upgrade I was wanting to get the most, but it is the one that we got, so. Just gonna go ahead and uh, give her that. And this. Then what? Another tank item, maybe? Yeah, another tank item's fine. I'll put it on a Moo Moo. I'll put this other tank item on him as well. A stone plate. I mean, if I could 3-star Soraka, dude. You better believe I'm 3-starring Soraka if I can. Okay, so... Heavenly, then stone plate, and then another stone plate, and she can have this, just to heal up a little bit faster. That looks fine to me. I'm, I really want to hit the Alawi for sure. Uh, I well, I guess I want to hit everything here, right? Oh man. I know he has that phantom trait that completely just brought my Alawi down to 30%. Look at a Mumu though. Mumu's kind of a beast. Uh oh. I don't think it's gonna matter if Set does true damage though. Although, when I put. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the true damage is pretty hardcore, man. Nice. Nice, I got him. I think the counter for that is just using that Lissandra. Dang, nothing, nothing. Nothing yet, dude. Two star Shen. I need this guy Elam so I can actually play my Lawi. Yeah, he's holding her. He's holding her hostage. This guy is holding some of them hostage too. I guess I can't hit her. There's too many gone from the pool. But I can hit Zoe and I think I can hit Soraka as well. So it's not like it's a bad idea rolling down this time or anything. I'm gonna give her this glove just to give her more crit. Oh, this Namzi is positioned perfectly to destroy us. Ah oh, man, she's whipped it so many times. The burn though, the burn hurts. Dang dude. Dang dude. 
Oh, this guy has Sorakas also. He has Sorakas and Zoe's. Just not that many. I think rolling down every round has been the right choice. It's gotten us a lot of three stars. And very close to a lot more. Three more three stars would really uh, spike my board, I think. Thinking of these gloves, it's the only thing that looks kind of good to me right now. Guardbreaker would be nice, actually, on Zoe. I'm gonna give Guardbreaker to Zoe. This is gonna be fine on her. Dang, dude. Dang, dude. Oh, there's there's my Zoe. I'm gonna go ahead and lock shop for her. I'm not gonna sell anything because I refuse to not three star everything, so. Then a gauntlet. I don't know who could use this gauntlet. Sure, Soraka, even though I know your spells probably can't crit. So, how about we put it on Malphite then? I know he could probably crit just attacking. I'm gonna put it right there just in case I fight Namzi again. He doesn't just shred both of them at once. Once she's three starred, she'll probably have a good chance at surviving at least. Oh, this is this. This guy has a lot of three stars also. Oh man, he's this board is really big, dude. I mean, he's made to counter me, actually. Yeah, he's definitely made to counter me. Yikes. Yikes. Well, I don't have all my three stars yet, so... Kind of to be expected here. Level 7 is definitely the highest chance of seeing the units that I need. Boss. This guy's so strong. It's mountain, bro. He took two mountain, and his whole front line is its just huge. I wonder if the other guy that had Alawi is gone now, so I can actually play that. I don't see him, but he only had two. Well, two of them is just exactly what I need, actually. Two of them is exactly how many I need. Dude, Lissandra, leave me alone, dude. I don't know if she could do anything to my... Moo Moo. So I would definitely add in Wukong. I think he might be my next best addition to my team. Wow, Zoe's really popping off now at 3 star. Who knew? She just needed a little oomph. Dang, everybody's gonna live. How long do the Divine rerolls last just for that round? Yeah, they only last for that round, so I have to use them no matter what. Which works out pretty great for me, because I really wanted to. I was gonna hold them though. Mm -mm -mm. This is a nice comp. Very unique and special nice comp. Yes, give me your crab. Give me your crab, brave. Oh, don't need that anymore. And an item. I'm gonna roll down. One more Alawi. There she is. Dude. Another... I don't know what item to get here. Blue buff? No. I need a tank item. I'm gonna give Alawi. It's her turn to be a tanky. Tanky Alawi. Okay, the last thing I should probably sell these. I will add Quay in next. More than likely. Oh, dude, what was that? My whole board almost got deleted. Please hit Namzi, dude. They just whiff Namzi every time. I think I just need to move her to the other side. I think if she's in the other side, she might actually live it. Oh? Dude, Alawi. Look at her Alawi go. I can't believe she beat Namzi like that. That's it's crazy. Oh, another way. Empathy. 24 gold, dude. That's rough. I don't have that much gold. Either way, it's kind of like... Okay. Yeah, this guy has two two-star Sorakas. He almost has a three-star, so there's no way I'm going to hit that unless he gets eliminated. I'm probably fighting him next, which I beat him last time. 
but he's really strong, so. I need to put another item on Alawi, I think. I think putting Heavenly on her would be better off than on a Moo Moo. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, for sure. It would be a lot better on her than a Moo Moo. She kind of almost soloed last time, and I think maybe if she would have had it, she would have definitely had a better chance to. Uh, this three star Yone is cracked, though. I don't know if I can stop this guy. One more cast, please? Oh, dude. Dude, I don't know, dude. Oh, I don't know, dude. <laughs> Moo kind of. I mean, without a Moo, I definitely couldn't have done that. Let me go ahead and go for the level. With love. Oh. Who am I going to fight next? Dude, this guy is crazy. I don't know if there's ever a way in hell that I beat this guy. And then the boss. The boss boss. I did this last round. This was hilarious. There's two of them going Umbral, so they've kind of been griefing each other. They're going Umbral in that set augment. Oh. Okay, uh, maybe I'll win? My board's been doing it pretty good so far. Just depends if the set is a uh, strong... I mean, is he a stronger carry than Yone? Maybe. Maybe so. His ult is kind of crazy. But if there's only one of them left, uh, might not be too bad. Oh man, he's just casting over and over, huh? Please stop missing. Yes, she did 3,000 damage. That's a lot. Ooh, there's my my girl there. I, I don't think I can add her in anymore, though, can I? Warden, no. Jeweled Gauntlet, maybe. Hey, I'll, I'll take Altruist. That's actually pretty good here. Altruist is not bad here. Definitely just makes my whole board tank here. Okay, did that guy with the Namzi? Yeah, he did. Rest in pieces, brother. There's one. There's the second one. And let me go ahead and do that. Heavenly. Whoops, I accidentally put this back on a Moo Moo, didn't I? I didn't mean to do that. That is not the item combination I wanted, but it might be good. Dude, I really have to make sure I put my Lux facing the opposite way of that. That chick back there, she's way too strong. She is getting stunned though. And she got stunned again. Oh, wow, dude, my board is so crazy. My board is so crazy. That's awesome. Dude, 15k damage. I did 15k damage on my, on my, um, Zoe. My Zoe did so much damage, that's crazy. Okay, this guy's playing the old comp. The old Umbral comp. These boards are so cool, though. You guys see this? It's a lot of three stars as well. Well, after this round, I'll have a three star Soraka, which should make make my board even better. More AP for everybody. This is actually not a bad item combination on my dudes here. Need another tank item though. I think another tank item would be pretty great for my Amumu. Dude? Oh. How am I even deleting people like this? This is just criminal. Kind of criminal. There's my three star Soraka. Sweet. This guy's about the three star Silas. He's very, very close. 
There's a Silas right there. I'm just gonna hold on to that, just in case. I don't know if I could beat a three-star Silas. I could certainly try, but I don't know if I'd succeed. Two big crabs. Two ginormous crabs. Let me get that. Here's Wukong. Could do five heavenly. Two champ dupes. Wonder if he got two champ dupes as well. No, he didn't. So I definitely just do this. And then... I would give Wukong a Bloodthirster, but I have this whole... Very superb backline of champions going on. Might win this. Oh man. He's tough. He is tough, but dude. Oh. That's crazy. I don't know if I can beat that Yone actually. He's just gonna stack infinitely to the point where he deletes my unit. Ooh. But if only I had a Thorn Mail. A Thorn Mail is kind of what I need right now. Okay, well, GG. If you guys enjoyed that, remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. GG.